Hi guys, welcome here again to another news still on the insecurity situation in Nigeria as we know a lot of things has been happening a lot of things are set to continue to happen until something is done concerning the present insecurity situation it has just been said that gunmen invaded a Catholic church in Anambra state they tied up the security guards of the church and they invaded the church what is your take to this in a church where there are security guards these gunmen invaded the church and tied up the security guards what is your take to this this is another insecurity situation happening in Charles Soludo's state as we all know Charles Soludo is the present governor of Anambra state now there is a huge tension in Anambra as this has happened again well, we would like you to see tight as we go into the full details of the news and see what has actually happened. According to the news, some gunmen wearing sophisticated weapons have invaded St. Martin of Tor Catholic Parish in the Ihiala local government area of Anambra State. Sahara reporters learned that the attack took place on Thursday night. This comes as the battle of the soul of the parish between the parishioners and concerned citizens of Ihala on the one side and the Catholic diocese of Inewi on the other side excavated. Although the mission of the hand men could not be ascertained immediately they were said to have been led into the church premises by two reverend fathers one of them the parish priest and a new parish created recently by the bishop of inewi diocese most reverend jonas benson okoye an eyewitness told sarah reporters on friday morning that the harmed men wore black attire and covered their faces also, according to the high witness, the assassins tied up the security guards at the church and this possessed them of their mobile phones. The parish priest of the church, Reverend Father Val Ezi, confirmed the invasion of the church to a local medium, Dorezo. He said the gunmen invaded the church and occupied the premises around 9.15 p.m. on Thursday. He however added that the invaders had not approached the residence of the priest, adding that we are safe in the parish house. Several reporters had reported that the Spiritians, otherwise called an as holy ghost father, who reside in the parish have not been celebrating masses in any houses as the bishop had revoked their faculty the parish of the diocese had accused the holy ghost fathers of not cooperating with the diocese in resolving certain issues including attempts to create new parishes out of saint martin's and payment or you know payments to the church to the owners of the land acquired by the church pardon what is your take to this what is your own reaction to this pen development we've just heard what has been said gunmen invading a catholic church in anambra tying up the security guards and they invaded the church now it was reported that these people were wearing sophisticated weapons and of course it is not new that when these guys are operating they are always with sophisticated weapons even if they were to attack police stations the police stations they have been attacking those police they don't have sophisticated weapons like these invaders had now they invaded our church a catholic church in anambra inside of the security guard this possessed them of their telephones and they invaded the church what is your take to this according to what has been said although the mission of the hammed men could not be ascertained immediately 
they were said to have been led into the church premises by two reverend fathers one of them the parish priest and a new parish created recently by the bishop of inewi Dalsis, most reverend jonas benson what is your take to this what is your own reaction to this pain development they were said to be in black attire up and down and their faces were also covered what is your take to this the insecurity situation in nigeria is actually you know denying nigeria of so many things nigeria has not been prosperous in so many ways and one of those things that is causing the setback for nigeria is the insecurity now if all these things continue you will agree with me that we wouldn't blame the agitators of this country who are saying that we cannot continue like this people are agitating saying that we need our own country we want to refrain them you don't blame them because nobody wants to die again according to what has been said by isa sodik say no place is safe in nigeria except asurok i don't think these gunmen have religion imagine a security personnel is tied up that mean no one is safe there what is your take to this we've just heard what has been said by isa sodik that there's no place that is safe in Nigeria, except probably the Asso Rock. What is your take to this? These gunmen are obviously not religious because if they have a religion, they wouldn't have done what they have done. Ayo Ayega have also reacted and said, Charles Chukuma Soludo, he is our useless governor. Don't go and provide security for your state. Be there composing long notes about OB. What is your take to this? Don't forget that of recent we had Charles Soludo, you know, talking about Peter OB presidential ambition and a lot of reactions from Nigerians. Now, it is said by Ayo that Chukuma should concentrate on providing security for his state and stop composing long notes about Peter OB. As you can see, Nigerians are not happy with the way insecurity have continued to be deviled in the state. Different reactions from the fame people who would like you also to let us know your own take on this. Gunmen invade Catholic Church in Anambra tied up security guards. Can you just imagine the incident that has happened like that? We would like you to share it all with us via the comment section. We should be even thankful and I'm sure IPOP will be thankful that IPOP and ESN are not tagged as the unknown gunmen in this situation. I would like you to let us know your own take on this. Thank you guys for listening. To subscribe to this channel if you have not. And I will see you on the other news. Bye for now.